got a 2015 F-150, the automatic windshield wipers, and they are off, but they don't actually shut off. They just kind of continue to run. And so I went over to the Napa and I had the guy order me a part to fix this. Um, we'll see if it works. The DL7693 and it looks like it's basically the same exact part. And uh, I'm gonna do a little install. So to take this column off, there is three screws on the bottom. There's seven millimeter. And we will just take them off. Once all those are off and out, I'm just gonna kinda grab this. Get it down like that. And just tuck it out of the way. There's two Torx head screws, one here, one there. We're gonna have to remove them. So there's actually a third Torx head you gotta remove. And then this will just pull out. I should. That just pops out, and then this one just pops out. So we will put our new one in, kind of looks basically the same. We'll see if the Napa guy got it right. Get that one in there, and put this control back in. I'll go upside down like that. Clicks in, and we're gonna give it a start. See if they kick on. They're not on. That seemed to fix it. Turn signal. Turn signal. Alrighty, we will put those Torx heads back in and button this up. So it took a little finesse to get this back on. So I took it back off. You can see down here, there's like a little, um, like a little groove there. That slides in to that groove in the back. So it like slides in and then clamps down. And that's it. I think total, it took me 10 minutes um, You don't really need much for tools just a Torx bit that is T10 seven millimeter socket and I use this you could probably go with a Ford But I use that DL 7693 so the guy behind the counter at Napa gave me and it worked out. Total the part was 50 bucks. And it's worth the hassle of putting it in.